one user experience improvement that we can make in our app is that say we're on the second page of stories in our app and we want to look at an individual story and its comments and when we're done with this we want to go back to the previous page well in our navigation we're only giving them the home page it would be better if we gave them a back button up here instead of forcing them to click on the the back button in their browser so we want to conditionally add a back button for the story page so we'll head to the story page and on our layout component we'll pass down a new prop called back button and we'll set that to true and then within our layout we'll receive back button from our props object and we want to display our back button to the left hand side of the link so we'll do it above link in our nav we'll include a conditional which will say if back button is true then we'll display some markup for the back button will be a span with the class name of back dash button and to display a back arrow we'll use the unicode value ampersand hash mark x 2b 05 semicolon and then we can style this within our nav we'll take the back button class and provide a rule where the font size will be 0 0.9 rems and the font weight I should say the padding right will be 1m to space it from the main title. If we save all that and take a look, we see our back button, but it doesn't do anything. We haven't added any functionality to it. So here we can't include a link to go to the previous page. We need to use some functionality from the router. So we'll import the router from next slash router and we'll change the route imperatively we'll use an on click so when the user clicks on this back button use an inline arrow function to take the router and execute a method on it called back so back will take users to the previous page that were, they were on and to tell our user that they can click on this span that clicking on it will do something for them we will in our rule for our back button set cursor to pointer to turn their cursor into a pointer icon. We'll save that, head back, and now you can see we're currently at a given story. We hit back, we're taken to the previous page, in this case page 2. We're not just taken to the home page, which of course if we clicked on the home link that's what it would do.